Hey everybody, uh, saludos desde España. Um, as you can tell, I'm not in my room like I normally am. I'm actually in Spain. Um, sorry I'm a little behind on the update. Uh, I've been having a lot of fun here in Malaga and then also in Granada. Um, but I wanted to film a quick update just to fill you guys in since I haven't uploaded my normal video. Um, been really busy uh, doing a lot of sightseeing. I've been to a lot of the monasteries in the area. I've been to the cathedrals, um, a couple other places, uh, the Alcazaba here in Malaga, um, also the Hibra Farlo. Um, those are both fortresses, castles. I would have really great views of the city. Um, just been having a good time here with the family. Just open up our gifts earlier this morning um, and right now we're just relaxing so I thought I'd film a quick little update um, this is my eighth month update I think I'm about a week behind um, my hair it's getting into that mullety stage I'll take a step back so y'all can see what it looks like um, yeah this is gonna be a impromptu video normally I try to think things through but this one's gonna be a little bit off the cuff uh, my hair is a little bit wet right now um, I try to keep it wet every time I do a video it keeps it kind of relaxed and less uh, less frizzy but if I were to pull a strand of hair down right now oh it's actually right at my nostrils but that's probably because I'm about 10 days or so late on my video um, hair length wise that's been about it it's a little bit unruly here on the sides it wants to puff out more than anything right now um, also getting a little bit longer on the back but that's yeah that's really about it um, during these past couple days, I've just been using apple cider vinegar, my leave-in conditioner, and then also my uh, Shea Moisture conditioner that I use in the shower. I um, haven't been using the Shea Moisture shampoo here recently because I actually left it back at home. Um, so I've just been using apple cider vinegar as a rinse and also as a shampoo. Um, yeah, this is the first time I've been to Europe, so it's been a lot of fun. Um, it's a lot different than back home in Dallas, Texas. Um, also, compared to really any other place in the States, um, people here are really friendly. Um, it's definitely a nice change of pace, especially being on vacation. Uh, oh, another update. Um, I think I also let you guys know last video, but I actually graduated college. So, I think that was, on, yeah, that was December 11th. It was the day I was supposed to do my update video, but I had family over and then also getting ready for my trip. That's one of the many reasons why I didn't film the update video. Um, but besides that, that's been pretty much it so far. I've done a lot of sightseeing, a lot of eating, a lot of walking. Um, it's definitely been definitely been a nice experience um, have a couple more days here I think I'll actually be leaving the 27th or 28th so I'm not really looking forward to leaving also the long flight um, I really enjoy it here been having a lot of fun um, I'll take a step back so the camera can focus on the background let you see a little bit of what I'm seeing or what I've been seeing these past couple days Um, those are actually fields of oranges. Um, here in this region, uh, the Malaga region, the Granada region, uh, also called the Andalusia region, um, they do a lot of um, oranges, lemons, olives. Um, they grow them all here on the countryside. So we actually have some here at the house that we're at. There's actually oranges. Um, 
that the owners have. They have orange plants that we can just pick from. Um, so we've been having like a lot of fresh juices. Um, also been able to eat them straight off the tree. So that's been really awesome. Um, the, de the temperature, the weather, it's here pretty nice. As you can see, it's pretty sunny out right now. I think it's around 2 or 3 o'clock. Um, it's been around in the 60, 60 degree Fahrenheit range. Um, that would be, I think, between 10 and 13 degrees Celsius. So it's just been a little bit chilly, but definitely a lot warmer than back in Texas. Um, I have a short, short sleeve shirt on right now. Mainly the only thing that I'd be wearing would be a long sleeve and a sweater at the most during the day. Um, I've been taking tons of photos while I've been here. Um, I know I was going to do a, a video showing you around, but I haven't been able to get around to it. I think what I'll do instead is I'll start an Instagram page. I'll have some hair updates and also I'll upload some normal photos from my trip since I've been here. Um, I think that'd be pretty cool. Y'all let me know what y'all think. Um, but besides that, that's been it so far. Um, hair hasn't really been much of a problem, just besides the sides right here. Um, I used to be really conscious when it was windy like it is right now that my hair would get blown everywhere make it frizzy, make it poof out, but uh, during my time here, my hair has kind of just stayed the way it is. It's only been towards the end of the days that it's really been puffing up or getting frizzy, but that's just normal. Um, I haven't been using any gels, uh, just been using my leave-in conditioner and my curl enhancing smoothie to get throughout the day, and that's been enough to keep it keep it uh, keep it normal looking like it is right now um, I know this isn't my normal type of video but I just wanted to put something out there because it's not I probably wouldn't get to a video until January but I'll be posting my ninth month video hopefully around my normal schedule which is around the 10th or 11th of January um, but that's been about it so far uh, if you have any questions or anything, uh, just let me know. I hope everybody's been having a very happy Christmas. Um, also, happy holidays. Um, I'll try to post more, try to uh, comment on y'all's videos. i just seen Raul's video up in uh, northern Norway. I think that's what it is, Norway. Um, super, super snowy and super cold compared to here. Um, but Europe's been awesome so far. Um, if the other parts of Europe or anything like this here in Spain, it's definitely something that y'all should check out. Um, but I'll talk to you guys next time. Uh, happy holidays. Merry Christmas. See y'all.